The government and the House of Representatives agreed to revise up the lower point of the 2022 economic growth target to 5.2% from the previous target of 5%. In a working meeting with the House of Representatives, the Minister of Finance Sri Mulyani ensured to raise the lower limit of Indonesia's economic growth target next year from 5% to 5.2% in the basic assumptions of the 2022 macroeconomy. Although the lower limit was revised, the Minister of Finance ensured that this was in line with the previous speech by President Joko Widodo, so that economic growth next year is targeted at 5.2% to 5.5%. Tidak pastian, kita tentu akan melihat faktor-faktor yang menyumbangkan pertumbuhan ekonomi baik dari sisi demand maupun supply, Pak. Ada di demand, tadi disampaikan oleh hampir termasuk berbagai pembicara tadi mengenai pentingnya konsumsi rumah tangga. Tadi dari seluruh fraksi hampir menyebutkannya seperti itu. Nah kalau polisi mengenai meningkatkan konsumsi rumah tangga, Kalau kita lihat dampaknya tadi yang disampaikan oleh BPS, COVID ini mem- mem- mempengaruhi terutama untuk desil 5 ke bawah, maka APBN dari sisi Bansos memang ditujukan untuk mereka yang ada di dalam desil terbawah itu. Sri Mulyani aided to pursue this target, the government did a number of things such as strengthening the handling of the health sector, optimizing spending on ministries and institutions, maintaining people's purchasing power, strengthening and sharpening programs for the recovery of MSMEs and business. From Jakarta, Adefirman Shafur, IDX Channel.